Hey guys, Nick Miller today from Mark Supply Company. Today I have for you a 2021 Kubota CT5550 tractor loader cab tractor. Um, very nice tractor. This tractor has just 35 hours on it. Gentleman bought this for an application. It did not work for what he needed it to do. Um, he needed the skid layer in his application. Um, don't even know why he was going this direction, but he did. Um, it is a nice tractor. There's 35 hours on it. It is like brand new. Uh, it does have full warranty on it until December of this year. Um, you can talk to a local dealer. They can sell you an extended warranty for this. Um, I did look into that. I think two years is right around $1,200. Um, really nice tractor. Cab heat air. Uh, what I like in these, these do have, I do believe they call it, um, I got to look. Uh, they call it linked pedal, which is really cool. Uh, works like a Kubota's uh, throttle, where as soon as you push the throttle, uh, as you push the hydrostat pedal, matches the engine RPM with the transmission so you don't have to run around with the tractor running wide open or three quarters all the time. Really, really nice feature. So it is cab heat air FL9-5 quick attach front loader with skid steer quick attach. It does have a 72 inch um, tractor style bucket with bolt on cutting edge. He must have left the bucket have some water in it. We did paint the bucket because the powder coat did lift on the bucket. The rest of the tractor is all original paint. Again, it's a 35 hour piece. Um, very, very clean, 100% ready to go to work. We're going to show you here under the hood. We're going to take you completely around this tractor. So, under the tractor, this hood, or yeah, under the tractor, this, under the hood of this tractor, if I could talk today, it's going to be powered by the Bobcat engine in this tractor. Uh, these are a three cylinder. This thing really, really runs nice. It has very good power. It's very quiet. Uh, cab heat air, all, everything there works. We did check everything out. It's not due for a service yet. Uh, very, very clean. No abnormal noises, smoke, blow by, anything of that nature. There again, it is a 35 hour tractor. So you're going to look here on the hood. Hood's excellent. Straight, clean, no dings, dents. Loader arms are beautiful. Again, all original paint. Two pin skid loader quick attach up front. R4 tires on it up front, uh, Carlisle Track Chiefs, those are a 10 16 5, um, like brand new. In the rear, Carlisle's also, again, um, and in the rear, this is a 17 5 24. Coming to the rear of the tractor, you can see nothing's been on the three point. Uh, the balls still have the factory paint on them, they do have an easy link arm which is very nice when you're hooking up three-point attachments. This does have a very, very nice quick link here for adjusting or a quick, um, quick adjuster on your three-point side. This does have the nice style um, links instead of the screw arms or, or uh, like a rod tie arm on your three-point. One other nice feature in this tractor is they have a handle back here that you can raise and lower your three-point arms whenever you are working to hook up an attachment. Very, very nice. Drawbar comes with, these do come standard with a clevis on there. Uh, it does come with that. We're not keeping it. It goes with the tractor. In the back, you do have an implement plug here for lights. Top link, factory top links with it. Does have one set of rear remotes with it, which is nice on this size of tractor. Does have the rear uh, grid heater in the window, rear work lights, cabin lights, front lights mirror kit. We're gonna take you inside the cab. Plastic is still on the seat. You can see inside is very, very clean. Uh, cloth seat, all original. Plastic is still on it, armrest. Over here, you're gonna have your low, medium, and high for your transmission. Coming over here, you're going to have your draft control, and you will have your up and down for your three-point. Loader joystick, hand throttle, auxiliaries here for the rear, for your rear remote throttle, joystick loader. Cruise control is right here. You got your, you can plus and minus, set or resume. Uh, cruise control for the PTO if you're on PTO. Here's your fine adjustment on some of that stuff. Linked pedal, no stall, stall, and then uh, you can set it to attack... Uh, I believe you can set it to an RPM you want it to stall at. Uh, lights, defroster, auto and manual PTO, four-wheel drive in and out. We're going to show you right here real quick. 35.1 hour. I'm going to go ahead, I'll shift this into neutral, which you'll see the little neutral. And if you're in a range, it's going to show you over here a high, medium, and low ranges. Range, four wheel drive in and out. Over here, I'll put the no stall on, and then right there, you're going to see it says linked pedal, and then non linked pedal. 
horn, all the other lights, rear view mirror, cab heat air, everything is air, ducted air and heat system. Very nice, very quiet tractor. Um, I'm really impressed with this tractor. It has a very nice cab on it. Um, very well made. Um, very industrial tractor. So we're going to run it around here, show you a little bit about it, and uh, kind of so you can kind of see it and get a feel for what it is. Here we go. So again, you have to be in neutral for this to start. Um, one nice thing, this LinkedIn pedal, you can take and put your foot on both the forward and reverse, and it's going to rev up the tractor, which is pretty cool. They've thought a lot about these tractors, uh, and there again, there'll be a lot of guys who are going to come right out and say this is a rebranded Coyote. It is, but there's a lot of nice options that a standard Coyote doesn't have that Bobcat has come up with, okay, which I feel is a good thing. We're going to turn our four-wheel drive on, and pretty help if I uh, click this in my new stall. Four-wheel drive working, four -wheel drive out. Put it back in. I'm running it right now in no stall. That way I have full capability of the hydrostat, which you can run it in the stall mode. What that's going to do is keep you from um, basically stalling your hydraulics if you're into heavy dirt work. So that was low range. We're going to go ahead and go to medium range now. The tractor is very spunky, has a lot of power. Very impressed with that. Go ahead and get a high range now. The tractor scoots along in, in high range. Uh, it's something there I will give it. I mean, they've got tremendous range and uh, tremendous uh, speed in high range. What is nice about a tractor like this, this is a big tractor. This will do a lot of work in compact size. And you can see the turning radius of this tractor. Very nice, very nice power steering. Horn. Tilt steering wheel. It's well planted to the ground for this side of the tractor. Suspension seat. So again, like new tracker, and this tracker is at a very affordable price. Um, I price my stuff in the market, I feel, very accordingly. Um, a lot of guys, you know, I guess they still think that they can ask whatever they want, but, but again, you are, I did run, have some numbers run, to, to buy this tractor brand new today. Uh, the equipped the way this tractor is, you're at $52,000, uh, plus your tax. So there is a massive savings on this tractor and save somebody a pile of money. There again, compared to this one. Um, what you will buy this tractor for, you basically can't buy a 30 horsepower tractor for. So somebody truthfully is looking for a like new tractor, here is something to take a look at. Um, like I said, I am very impressed with this tractor. Um, Again, it still does have factory powertrain warranty. There's an emissions warranty on it yet. Um, it's been December this year. It was purchased new December of, of um, 21. I'll be very honest with you. If anybody runs a tractor, does not use this uh, link to battle in a day is that it can be. Uh, you know, the competitive tractor, the Kubota in this class, has what's called a Kubota for it, which I have not done because of their day in the life. Many, many, many of those with that uh, auto throttle, and I love the auto throttle. It's just, it's nice when you're working the track, you're not running around and you've got this thing screaming wide open when you're doing 
done something, you know, it's nice when you come up higher end, the Lux tractors, the uh, majority of them are cab. Uh, they do still offer that on their you know, non-cab units. But and again, this is a nice side track in case you're freaking working with. This is not a tour. Uh, what's nice about this, you can go ahead, get yourself a set of nice forks, you can get a nice grapple for this, if you put a set of auxiliaries on, or you do have the set of auxiliaries right here, uh, you can get them on the front level gauge on the bucket, um, just an extremely nice tractor. Guys, if you have any questions, cab, heat, air, uh, four ways, all the lights work, horn, it's kind of cool they have a horn button and a steering wheel, one also on turn signals. Uh, four ways, turn signals, everything there works. You got front and rear um, work lights, you got your windshield wiper, you got your rear defroster, PTO, cruise control, joystick loader. Um, really just a, an awesome little tractor. Um, don't be fooled by these. I mean, they are a 50 horse tractor. And again, you can do a lot of work with this tractor, save a pile of money here compared to a new one today. Uh, any questions, 814-658-3066. Keep in mind, so you got a 50-horse tractor, Cat 1-3 point hitch, top link draw bar, 72-inch uh, OEM buckets on it um, with a bolt on cutting edge. you got a set of rear remotes, um, rear view mirror kit, front and rear work lights, uh, R4 tires, a beautiful tractor, and again, it's 35 hours, all original piece. It just did not fit this customer's bill and what he was trying to do. Um, any questions, 814-658-3066. Please let us know. We'd be glad to help in any way that we can if you need a freight quote. That's why we take the time to do these videos. We take more pictures than anybody out there. We do these videos. I like to sell nice, clean, honest equipment. That is what we strive for here. I'm not into auction junk. Uh, I bought this right from a dealer. Uh, very, very nice piece. Any questions, 814-658-3066. As always, have a great day.